Welcome back to Learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to adjust all text elements in a project at once. Someone in the comment section asked me how to do that. So we've got this option right here. When you uncheck it, you can scale your object down without adjusting the stroke. And when you check it, the stroke is also adjusted. So you can see that right here it goes from 10 to 7.4. Let me press Ctrl Z. Now I uncheck it and if I scale it down, the stroke width stays the same. If that doesn't work for you, just go to Edit Preferences and under Behavior, Transforms, uncheck this box for Scale Stroke Width and then it should definitely work. So let me scale this down and you can see it stays at 10. So normally the last style of the text element that you've created is saved. So when you create a new one, it has the same style. I once used this vertical text, so I've got this still active. Let me rotate that, but you can see it has the same fill, the same stroke, and even the same stroke width. All of them have a width of 10. Let me check this box and I resize them a little bit to, to give them different stroke width sizes. So you can see that right here. And the question was, what if you've got all of these text elements and you want to give them the same stroke width? So what's the quickest way to do that? Quickest way is to select one, then right click, select same. And then select under this drop down the object type and you've got all text elements selected. Let me just create these basic elements so that you can see that they are not selected. So I select this text, right click, select same object type and everything is now selected in my project except for these two non-text elements. And now I set the stroke width on a stroke style to 10 and all of my text elements now have this same width. So this would be the easiest way to solve your problem if I understood it correctly. You could also select by fill color as the other elements have a black fill and my text elements have a red fill. So only find some similarity between all of your text elements and then select same and use that to select your text elements. Then go to fill and stroke. You can find that under object. And then adjust the stroke, the fill, the stroke style, whatever you want to adjust. And it should save you a lot of time. I hope I've answered your question. If not, let me know in the comment section below. In any case, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.